So Volvo put me into their Polestar electric car. Now they pointed out that there was a bit of a problem with the recharging system and it only had 220k of range. But I figured, oh, I can get a decent day's drive out of that. I headed northeast from Toronto up towards Peterborough. And by the time I got up there, I realized I was running short. I wasn't going to make it back home. Well, surely a city of size of Peterborough is going to have recharging stations. Well, I found a couple, but they required that you be registered. I tried to register on, my, on the internet on my phone, couldn't make it happen. Well, I found a Tesla recharging station at the Lansdowne Plaza in downtown Peterborough. They had, I think, seven stations. Every one of them was empty. Not a lot of Teslas in Peterborough. But they have a separate plug. The plug for my car didn't fit. So I did find a recharging station at a restaurant in the east end of town. And they let me plug in. It did work. They weren't sure it worked, but it did. But it was going to take about an hour so I had a very nice hamburger. I got about 100K of range out of this charge after about an hour. It's 120K back to Toronto, but I figured, well, a 20 kilometer flatbed tow was better than a 120 kilometer flatbed tow. So I drove home, coasting down hills, going about 75K on the 401, made me very popular with the other drivers, in the right lane, of course. And of course, every intersection I passed, there were four gas stations on every corner. But fortunately, there had been a crash on the Don Valley Parkway, which slowed traffic down. I was able to limp back to the dealership with about 15K range left on the car. <sighs> but I now know what they mean when they talk about range anxiety. I'm Jim Kenzie. So here's the question. Where were you 32 years ago? I know some of you weren't even a glint in your father's eye. As for me, well, I was in diapers, but found time to get motoring TV off the ground. And today, I like to think we've got one of the best automotive video libraries in the world. If you agree, please give us the thumbs up and also subscribe. We really appreciate it.